Is HR 2791 really responsible? Well, it relies on outdated data. It violates U.S. trade obligations. It regulates this industry as hazardous waste. It's politically unachievable. So, sorry, but no, it's not really responsible. And the rationale for the bill is based on the false proofs. That the reason why we need an export ban the bill, a very aggressive trade restriction, is that 80% of all the material you handle is going over to the development world. Well, what's different from this year? versus the prior years, we now have a body of reports and surveys that tell a different story. The International Data Corporation, this is something we commissioned in 2011, took a survey of the marketplace. The U.S. International Trade Commission came out with a report. How about the United Nations report, MIT? How about the Congressional Research Service? All bipartisan organizations putting forward policy to say what's really going on. Based on the U.S. IPC report, one of the strongest commissions in Washington, used throughout the Congress for single reports, things are, this market is doing quite well. Over $20 billion in annual revenue sales, 4 million total tons processed annually in the United States. We estimate that our market is somewhere around 7 million tons. And 45,000 direct and indirect employees.